दिस सीजन देखते हैं कि शूट का कितना जाता है आई हैव सीन द हाइज एंड आई सीन द रियली बैड लोज आई एम वेरी वेरी थैंकफुल दैट इफ देर आर देर थैंक यू सो मच फॉर योर लव एंड प्रेयर थैंक यू Well, uh, life professionally has been very busy in the past uh, few months. Uh, managing a radio show and managing a television show and managing your anchoring events, uh, it's it's crazy, but it's good fun as you can see. All the soundproofing in my studio here. I do my radio show while I am on sets, while I'm shooting. So it's a lot of uh, less hours of sleep, but it's good. Well uh, I am uh, doing a lot of work I mean I'm doing two different jobs in a day one is acting one is radio hosting so but I want more I want uh, to uh, you know make up for all those uh, uh, two years that I was not working so yeah I want to work more I want to meet you guys more and I want to talk about more work very soon Chana Meria happened with a call of the creative director who's me who basically wanted to work with me from my debut show which is Bandini and uh, she wanted to cast me in a lot of Balaji shows also it didn't happen then she wanted to cast me for Kali Re it didn't happen then she called me one fine day that I'm going to Dubai can you help me out so I thought she just called me for the help I said yeah these are the people you can she's like sir by the way you have to audition tomorrow I said I was like joking so then I just gave the audition and I forgot about it and then I had gone to uh, my hometown where my mother was on her deathbed and that's when the actual call happened and i said i cannot come because my mother has just passed away and uh, if you want to like you know probably replace me aap kisi aur ke sath kaam kar le and uh, then she could, she called me like no 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 we are going to wait for you and the first schedule is in amritsar and my mom wanted to go to amritsar so i was like that's maybe a sign and i should do it and uh, they waited for me and i came back and uh, that's how it happened at that time honestly after losing my mother i wanted to be busy i wanted to be around people who you can feel comfortable with um when i was told that karan bhai he is playing my best friend and uh, uh, the stylist of the show has worked on my debut show the creative director i knew so there were so many comfort factors there are two three more people who have worked in the show pehle hi so it was like a comfort factor at that time and i honestly wasn't thinking whether the show is going to do well whether the characters are going to do well i was like i just want to be busy and that was my honest reason of doing the show i um i am coping with it just like any individual would there are good days there are bad days there are horrible days uh and you experience all of them and uh, you just keep working you just keep moving i mean yesterday only it was a horrible day because it was 6 month anniversary or whatever you call it uh, my my mother passed away 6 months back so it was a very bad day uh today morning i woke up and i came on the sets and uh, that's how you cope up that's how you cope up with anything in life i think you just keep moving and uh, yes there will be good and bad days both i mean grief doesn't go away you just have to learn how to manage your grief No I genuinely uh, did not think uh, about it at all because uh, honestly uh, right now how television is consumed or how any any uh, OTT films are consumed is nobody knows what's happening Uh, if that was to Vicky Kaushal would have never become a leading hero because he started playing a uh, best friend of Ranbir Kapoor so i mean there goes the logic that you know you can't play a hero's friend and be a hero and uh, i've already played a hero and uh, it happens in television a lot that once you've played a hero then people don't want to repeat you the ekdam se and there are so many actors who play different kinds of characters and i do not approach uh television as a career right now uh, to be very honest i am doing my radio this is fringe benefits whatever i get to do with my radio my condition is very very simple that i need to keep doing my radio so like you know day before yesterday when i had to go and shoot an interview with rakhi savant i told them that i'm not available and they managed it so i am not looking at television like a kyu yehi mera bread and butter hai because i've gone through that phase where uh pre big boss i had nothing 
so uh, i was at zero this is better than zero so i genuinely don't think that you get typecast or you get this thing because if if that was true my first show i played a negative character uh, i would have never become a lead i have become an anchor on various shows so people would not want to see me as a serious character i don't really believe in it honestly most people do television for money and uh, that's my reason of doing it too i mean it's not like we are all making oscar winning films so and i'm aware of about it and uh, yeah i'm very realistic about it exactly like how it is on screen uh, the 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 way that they wanted to show is that we are like you know really close and i get him and all that stuff i think from day one why when we met in amritsar or when we met for the script reading only or when he came to know both of us had a comfort factor that we have someone that we know and uh, it's it's great for if, if if you guys were there while we were shooting the scenes you must have seen that in between the scenes uh we keep doing a lot of fun and that's my exact equation with karan and it's uh, uh how people write in memes about chanda meria that karan has two heroines one is me and one is niyati that's actually true uh in the sense that you know uh, all three of us are very very thick with each other and uh, i think once you once you enjoy working with someone uh that that comfort starts showing on screen also I don't uh, think so that I am in the same league as Karan and Tejasvi to be no I mean they are in much better league uh, to be very honest in terms of popularity in terms of the work that uh, they are doing I mean she's doing a very big show and she's the face of it uh, so is Kundra uh, but I'm very very um happy that all of us are acting post big boss because what happens post big boss to a lot of people is that you keep getting a lot of reality show offers you keep getting a lot of Instagram collabs but you're not acting i mean we've seen so many actors in big boss who have not been able to act because aap jaate hi uh, acting karne ke liye ho aapke millions of followers ho jaate hain aap twitter par trend karte rehte ho but you're not cast in any web series or in any this thing so i'm very happy that uh, yes there are people who are uh, getting to do that but i don't really think so that it's um, related to big boss honestly you know uh, if you're being cast as an actor for a show it has nothing to do with big boss yes uh, for some time you can take a face ki bhai ye bahut popular ho gayi hai inko hum le lete hain taki audience aa jaye but beyond that no i mean you know it is a separate thing in fact a lot of actors have to face the problem of not getting cast in my season also there were people who are not getting cast but hamari season se i think people have become a little more open um uh, pavitra is acting on television back again i am acting uh, uh rubina uh, is uh, acting so a lot of people are acting so yeah uh, that is part true ki aisa hota hai industry ke log aapko ek alag tarike se dekhte hain aur also aap apne dimag mein bahut alag ho jate ho aapko wo fame aur wo adulation aur wo sab aapko itna real lagne lag jata hai ki you start asking for unheard of prices नहीं अफोर्ड कर सकते ना प्रोडक्शन हाउसेस उस तरह का बजट या आपकी कंडीशंस जैसी हो जाती हैं सो इट्स अ बोथ वे थिंग आई स्टिल डू वी पार्टी जस्ट फोर फाइव डेज बैक टुगेदर एंड आई हैव सीन एंड डिस्कस्ड एवरीथिंग विथ रुबीना एंड आई थिंक माई लास्ट मैसेज टू आर वॉज ऑल्सो लाइक दैट यू नो आई थिंक दे शुड मेक हर किस मोर फ्रॉग्स एंड शील हेट मी फॉर दिस बट आई आई टोटली लवड सींग दैट आई वॉज वेरी हैप्पी फॉर रुबीना वैन शी गॉट टू डू झलक एंड आई वॉज टेलिंग दैट दैट आई नो हाउ बिग माधुरी फैन शी इज एंड आई एम अ बिगर माधुरी फैन सो वी यूज टू टॉक अबाउट माधुरी अ लॉट इन साइड द हाउस ऑल्सो सो आई एम वेरी वेरी हैप्पी फॉर हर एंड आई थिंक रूबीना इज किलिंग एवरी थिंग दैट शी डज यू नो बिग बॉस खतरों के देन झलक आई एम वेरी श्योर दैट शी विल बी ग्रेट एट झलक बिकॉज ए शी इज अ ग्रेट परफॉर्मर एंड अ ग्रेट फेस एंड एन एक्ट्रेस बी आई थिंक शी इज वेरी इंडियन you know how madhuri or vidya and all these ladies were so she has that quality and i'm very very sure that she'll do well and she better does yeah honestly no because uh, uh, 
जैसे आप लोग हमें नाम बता रहे हैं हमें वहीं से पता चलता है सो नॉट नॉट लाइक आई नेवर कॉल्ड समवन एंड सेड आई एम डूइंग बिग बॉस यू नो आई मीन द ओनली टू पीपल हु न्यू अबाउट इट वर्स करण पटेल एंड अंकिता बिकॉज द फैमिली टू मी बट आई डोंट थिंक सो एनी कंटेस्टेंट विल कॉल पीपल एंड टेल देम दैट मैं बिग बॉस कर रहा हूँ बिकॉज इट्स अ पार्ट ऑफ योर कॉन्ट्रैक्ट यू आर सपोज टू नॉट टेल पीपल सो नो आई डोंट नो आई मीन आई हैव ओनली बीन हियरिंग दैट दिस वन कमिंग दैट वन कमिंग वाई आर न्यूज सो आई रियली डोंट नो ऑफ एनी बडी हुज गोइंग अभी दिस सीज दिस सीजन देखते हैं कि शूट्स का कितना जाता है लास्ट सीजन आई वॉज नॉट डूइंग अ फिक्शन शो सो आई हैड ऑल द टाइम बट आई थिंक टाइम निकाल सकते हो यार आपको जब निकालना होता है एंड आई थिंक आई एम नॉट वन ऑफ दोज हुल से कि नहीं मैं बिग बॉस नहीं देखूंगा ऑफकोर्स मैं देखूंगा आई बीन अ पार्ट ऑफ दैट शो ऑफकोर्स आई विल आई नॉट वॉच इट सो या आई विल आई आई विल ओनली वॉच वीकेंड का वार फर्स्ट शोर ये तो मुझे पता है ये तो पक्का बात है वेर आई एम एट peace because um, i have seen the highs and i have seen the really bad lows and uh, right now i'm at mid level somewhere uh, so i know that uh, all of this nothing like doesn't matter what matters is if you're happy because you know um, interviews will happen when you're doing a reality show or you're doing a lead and this and that and then they'll not happen and then so you can't base your success on that instagram followers can go up drop you can't base your success on that money can come and go and you can't base your success on that we've seen big big successful people going away just like that so i think i just want to be happy and at peace that's my new definition of success i think post 30 aapki definition of success change ho jati hai so yeah meri bhi change ho gayi hai I just want to say uh thank you so much and uh, I I I get very uncomfortable when someone asks ki aap apne fans se kya kehna chahte ho because I don't really I don't really believe that uh Shah Rukh Khan aur Madhuri Dikshit ko chhod ke koi kisi ka fan ho bhi sakta hai because I think only they deserve that kind of this thing so I call them supporters yes and I I am very very thankful that uh if there are there uh, thank you so much for your love and prayers and uh, uh, please keep uh, watching because uh, I'm trying to create a different niche and let's see how it goes Hi my name is Shardul Pandey and you're watching me on Glitz Vision USA